Does God's word say that it is against his teaching to help adult children financially? Now, that's a good question. Thanks for this question. While the Bible does not directly forbid helping adult children financially, there are some warnings about laziness that are in Scripture. Sure, there are times when adult children can use help, but it is unwise to reinforce bad behavior by saving them from natural consequences of their bad decisions. Those consequences are designed by God to motivate them to make different decisions. If by helping financially, we shield them from the motivation that they need to make different decisions, then we're actually hurting them, not helping them. That's why 2 Thessalonians chapter 3 and verse 10 says, Even when we were with you, this we commanded you, that if any would not work, neither should he eat. Nothing is a, a better motivator to get someone to quit living off the government or quit laying around and doing nothing than if you're not working, you're not eating. All of a sudden, guess what? He gets a sense of urgency. I'm hungry. Galatians chapter 6 and verse 7. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. Whatsoever man soweth, that shall he also reap. So, if, you know, best case scenario for kids, for adult kids, adult children, we learn, we live, everything's wonderful. Somebody tells you, this is what you ought to do. It's wise counsel. You follow it. Great. But a lot of times we don't. We hear wise counsel and we say, eh, forget it. I'm going to do it my way. Well, now what can help us to motivate our behavior? The law of sowing and reaping. The law of consequences. Uh, other, other religions still pick up this universal law. They call it the law of karma. But it's the same law. You know what? There are consequences for your actions. If I do bad things, bad things happen. So as a parent trying to decide whether or not to help an adult child, are you shielding him or her from the consequences they need to change your behavior? Did they spend their rent money on booze? Well, if they did, then you shouldn't be paying, spending their, uh, paying their rent. Because now that they've got no motivation to change that. Simple uh, law of consequences, sowing and reaping. I hope that that helps you.